I say all the time how much I love my job and I do, but yesterday I got a real treat with my job. I was on the phone with one of my children and I wasn't sure about what I was about to do and I was almost gonna turn down this opportunity. And my daughter said, mom, are you crazy? Who would ever turn down a chance like that? So the chance I had was to drive home a very lovely Lexus rental car, courtesy of Richmond Blackwell at Blackwell Automotive. He now has a rental car uh, component to the business because you wanted me to give you my honest feedback mm -hmm. on what it was like. And I'm so glad I listened to Emily because I loved my experience yesterday. Well, good. Yeah, well, we've decided to go into the rental car business because it just makes sense for us since we're already in the, the Lexus and Toyota repair business. Right. And so we, we went out and got several used Lexus SUVs and Toyota vans and Lexus cars. So it gives people a nice option when they need to rent something. Well, here's the thing, and I don't mind just giving people full disclosure. So I truly was on the fence about doing it because I knew the rains were coming in and you're always more comfortable in your own car. Mm -hmm. I thought, gosh, what if I did something to Richmond's car? I'd never forgive myself. So I, I drove away in a what, a Lexus SUV, uh, uh, mm -hmm. right? It's the RX 350, which is like the midsize kind of SUV that okay. Lexus makes. I don't drive a Toyota and I don't drive a Lexus. So the dashboard was not in any way familiar to me. It was a foreign car, mm -hmm. pardon the pun. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, again, it was so easy to acclimate to and it drove like it was my own car. Nothing about it felt like a rental car. And I don't know how to make that make any sense, but it was just immediately comfortable. Yeah, and, and that's what Toyotas are known for. They're known for being simple and, you know, extra reliable and simple cars, but still has a great ride. And, and that's what we wanted to give people because mm -hmm. a lot of the time you go to the rental car place and you get stuck with what they have or something really small, but we've gotten these cars for the same price or cheaper than what you would pay for an economy car. Right. And you get a good, solid, nice riding. You know, vehicle. to that point, it's been a long time since I've rented a car, but sometimes you'll go in thinking you're gonna get one thing mm -hmm. and they don't have that, so you're, you're gonna get something else. And I guess mm -hmm. you should be grateful for getting something. But if the steering wheel doesn't hold right, or sometimes there are really bad blind spots, or you spend mm -hmm. some time just adjusting in your seat, Mm -hmm. Everything about this, I didn't do one thing but hit start and drive the car. It that's, was so easy. That's wonderful. and that, That's why we try to stay with, we've got the Lexus ES350, which is the regular sedan, and the RX350, which is the, the SUV, and then the Toyota Sienna minivan, all of which the main controls are all the same. The headlights work the same way. Mm -hmm. uh, if you get booked for a sedan, that's the only one we have, so you're not going to get bumped down or or anything oh. when it comes to that. So we try to keep it as simple as possible. And worst case scenario, we don't have one of those. You get bumped up to an SUV or something, you know, even a little nicer, so. I think you, because you've been doing this now for a couple of months. So mm -hmm. when we talked the last time, we focused on this too. Part of what you're wanting to do also is give people a fair price. Yeah, and that's what, we've researched the pricing that goes into it. We try to keep it the same price, you know, through the holidays, through the weekends. If you book it for seven days, it's gonna be the same price, whether it's over the Christmas holiday or over the weekend or through the week, mm -hmm. it doesn't matter. We try to do, uh, based off the industry standard, try to give somebody the best price we can. And I guess because, like you said at the beginning, this is what y'all focus on specifically at Blackwell is mm -hmm. Toyotas and, and Lexus, then you can make sure that it's always in tip top shape. Oh, yeah, we do. And the, being able to have the, all the same cars, we have an inspection sheet that's a page long every time that the car comes in and before it goes back out. So mm -hmm. we're not just bringing it in, washing it, vacuuming it, and sending it back out. We go over this, this inspection page to make sure that the battery's still good and that nothing happened from the last time it was rented and the wipers still wipe good and the power ports still work and the spare tire's still in there and it's still got air in it. Mm -hmm. And so, and having the same cars, it's easy for our staff to go right to it and get it checked out and they know exactly where to look and what to look for to make sure that it's good to go. You did want to make sure this word got out in time for the holiday season. Mm -hmm. I know one of the things you always love doing at the automotive shop is getting your windows painted and mm -hmm. decorated for Christmas, and you've already got your jelly sale going on. Yeah. Talk about that. Uh, we've got these jellies that are made by a lady that uh, she does it to raise money for the, the Alton Park Church of Christ daycare. 
but uh, these are available at the store for just five dollars a piece which we don't know how she even does them for five dollars <laughs> but she loves doing all kinds of different flavors so she's got uh, strawberry and blackberry but then she's also got uh, peach with jalapenos and there's probably 30 different options that she does and we love it because it helps her but it also helps the community and it, it just adds a little bit of Christmas to the shop. And so. how fun would that be, whether it's for Christmas or coming up for Thanksgiving, if you were to go in and get some of these and bring or give to somebody, mm -hmm. and they said to you, oh, where did you get them? And you said Blackwell Automotive. Who would ever think you can buy <laughs> uh, art there mm -hmm. at, the, at the store? Yeah, we've got the Photographic Society comes in once a quarter and changes all our pictures out. And we'll have between 35 to 60 pictures in there, and they change every three months. So. If you're looking for a unique Christmas idea, you can get these for $5 a piece. Mm -hmm. If you've got like office presents that you need to buy, or you can come and get some local art that you're not gonna see anywhere else because it's all you know, amateur photographers. And let me ask you, if someone is having their car, their own personal car repaired with you, mm -hmm. if it should be kind of a lengthy fix, mm -hmm. can they take one of your rental cars? They can, Okay. Uh -huh. we've got them there for that. If your car's going in the body shop, if your car's been in an accident and you have to wait to get it in the body shop. Mm -hmm. uh, they're there for that. If you've got family coming in from out of town, uh, we've got the minivan. So if you need extra room and your car won't fit them, or if you don't like your family and need a little car so they won't fit in your minivan, we've got <laughs> the smaller cars. So we're, we're here, you know, whatever you need, we'll work it out, so. All right. <laughs> That was a good one, Richmond. I wasn't prepared for your humor this morning. <laughs> so you can find them on Eastgate Loop uh, in the Brainerd area, just off of Brainerd Road. 648-8001 is the phone number. You can go to blackwellautoinc.com, but then this new side of the business is Blackwell Rental Cars. It is. And uh, give them a call. Can they call that number also? They can. About the rental uh -huh. car? And then uh, you can go to our website for Blackwell Automotive or chattanoogarentalcars.com. Either one will take you to the uh, the rental car side. And I like the sound of the peach with the jalapenos. I bet that's yummy. It is. If you want something neat for your charcuterie board with cheese and different kind of jam, we've got it. So.